spend some time with your spouse. Have a date night, even with little ones. Five, six, seven, five o'clock. All right, time for bed. What? <laughs> yep, mommy and daddy are having a date in the living room tonight. Love you, man. Mm. <laughs> you don't have to go to bed. I just don't want to see your face till in the morning. Like, and you got to be confident about that. Well, they won't stay in their room. Well, if you think they won't, then they won't. Like, approach it with some confidence. Push the chairs together, pull out all the snacks that they normally get to eat. Because I'm going to tell you what, sometimes a Hot Pocket or, you know, little pita rolls, I mean, sometimes those are pretty good. <laughs> the donuts, whatever, put on that movie you want to watch. Just chill, just hang out. Your children do not have to be a part of every single thing that you do. And here's what else. You don't have to go to every single birthday party they're invited to. You don't. Those things are torture. <laughs> you're hanging out with people you don't know. You've got to sit around and make chit-chat, act like you're friendly. Your wife's getting on you about, don't say this and don't bring that up. And so-and-so don't like this. And you get the whole drive. He doesn't even want to be there. You're like in a snip by the time you even get there. You're putting on this whatever. Your kid's acting a fool and you're making excuses. Well, I think he's teething or he's getting a cold. <laughs> it's just a giant hot mess. It's so unnecessary. Like, we never, like, being a teacher, you get invited to every party under the sun, right? Like, I love you, but I am not going to spend time with you on the weekend. Like, I need a break from you. <laughs> I mean, they knew that. My kids would even say, when it was someone's birthday in the classroom, I taught kindergarten and first grade, Miss Stacy, um, it's, just, it's all, because the phrase in our classroom was, it's not all about you. It's not about you. So on their birthday, it's about them today, though, right, Miss Stacy? Yes, today, and then back to life tomorrow. Like, we're not going to drag this out. It's not like a whole birthday month kind of thing, whatever. My daughter even brought home an invitation. I guess she was middle school, and she said, yeah, I got invited, but we don't do birthday parties, so, and she, like, chucked it behind her in the back seat. I'm like, it's not we don't do birthday parties. I'm like, okay, maybe we don't do birthday parties, and I get it. Like, the other part of my personality, dude, Pinterest board rocks. Like, like, I want that closet. I want that bedroom. I want that goodie bag. Like, like I like to entertain, so it's really hard not to buy into all of that, but use that energy, ladies, guys, if that's you, for your own friends. That's way more fun, right? Here's what I suggest for birthday parties. If you have a landscaping job that needs to be done in your yard, maybe you got a couple holes to fill in, you got some patchy grass, maybe you're wanting to do another flower bed, have somebody haul over like a dump truck load full of dirt, invite over like five kids, tell them where they play clothes, let them go at it. They'll knock it about halfway down for you so you won't have that much work. Boom, best birthday party ever.